As many of you have probably seen, smoke is trickling down from the more than 90 wildfires in Canada, making for a difficult afternoon for some. So in this week's WeatherWise, Chief Meteorologist Amy Met shares how pressure changes brought the thick smoke our way. Amy? Yeah, you may have seen Brooke or heard us talk so much about low pressures, high pressures, and that has a, such a big impact on weather. So what's happening here is wildfires are up toward our northwest, but at the same time, because of a low pressure system, the air was directed right over North Dakota. So highs usually follow low pressure and that causes huge impacts to the weather. Low pressures are associated with storms, cold fronts along storms, and then behind that usually are clearer skies with high pressures. Now with this cold front in mind, what's happening here, strong lows, they'll cause that wind shift. So ahead of the cold front, this blue line here is going to be a south wind. After that, there's a northwest wind that almost always follows cold fronts. Because of that, we've been forecasting for these gusts to be about 35, 40 miles per hour through Friday morning. So with that being forecast and also having the wildfires there, unfortunate conditions are underway in Canada for fighting these fires. Instead of getting smaller, they're growing at the same time that our low pressure was growing its intensity, forcing that air even faster and faster from the wildfires right overhead. So that's going to be the strongest along that cold front, but the good news is, is that it will be moving away. That high pressure, because it weighs more, it will sink and expand. So with a high pressure near Canada today, that ended up pushing that smoke toward us at the surface, but eventually, as things continue progressing eastward with these pressure systems, we will end up with a high pressure back here Tuesday. Very, very strong, warm, weather then, excuse me, strong heat there. But as far as we're looking at for that wind shift, that's coming into play on Saturday. So by Saturday, we'll be seeing all these visibilities much different than right now. We have low visibilities in effect for a lot of tomorrow, but slowly that will be retreating as well as the air quality report. So just to give you a heads up, it's not going to be safe to get outside where we have these reds in effect with the air quality right now.